Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Edmond Mindaros and for today's quick tutorial and I'm going to show you guys on how to resolve if you're coming across an issue on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer that reads that no speakers or headphones are plugged in and most commonly reasons such types of problems occur due to corrupted drivers. And then I'll show you some steps to troubleshoot to fix this issue. And without further ado, and let's go ahead. So the first solutions we will do is to run the audio troubleshooters. So all you have to do is tap it up on a search menu. And then here at search for apps. And then you need to type troubleshoot settings. And then click open. So here at troubleshoots. And then you need to select other troubleshooters. And then here again at other troubleshooters and then you need to select this audio and on right side you can see here the run and then you need to tap this run settings and open up here at help and support all right so you can see here everything the step-by-step -step method and procedures and the complete informations on how to fix this error and then you need to follow one by one so once you're done here at help and support and the other solutions we will do is to disable and re-enable Realtek High Definitions Audio Driver. So all you have to do is to right-click on Start Windows button. And then you need to select Device Manager. And once you open up here at Device Manager, and the next step, then you need to select Audio Inputs and Outputs. So click this arrow to expand. And then you need to select speakers realtic audio so all you have to do is to select and right click and then you need to disable this device so after disable and then go back here again at device manager and then click enable all right and then after that the audio inputs and outputs and the next steps that we are going to do is to select the sound video and game controllers so you need to select this realtic audio so all you have to do is to select and then right click and then again you need to disable this device and then after disable and then go back here at device manager and then you need to enable this device. Alright so once you're done here at device manager and the other solutions we will do is to check the status of the Windows audio service. So all you have to do is to press the Windows key plus letter R on your keyboard and open up here at run so here in box then you need to type this command keyword services that msc so just type this command keyword services that msc and then click ok and once you open up at services and services local and on right side and then we need to find and locate this windows audio services so you need to scroll down and then find windows audio services so all you have to do is to select and then right click and then you need to check if it is already running or not but if not running and then you need to select this restart so since the services is already running and then you need to select this restart all right so click restart and then after restart and then all you have to do is to double click and then here at general properties startup type and then you need to select automatic and then click apply and then click ok all right so once you're done here at services and then close and here at start menu and then we need to restart all right so click restart okay so that's it guys on how to fix noise speakers or headphones are plugged in in windows 11 and please don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel for more quality content thank you guys and see you in my next tutorial